Hi friend, I'm Laya. Welcome to this 10 minute morning yoga class, ideal for beginners or for when you're short on time and you still want to get on your mat and connect to your body. Notice how you're feeling mentally and energetically so that you can move into your day with clarity and more focus. So bring yourself to a comfortable seated position on the ground, sitting however you'd like, and for a moment relax your shoulders down and away from the ears as your spine lengthens, and soften your gaze down or close your eyes. Take a deep breath in through the nose, and out through the nose or the mouth. Become aware of the sounds around you, sounds of people, of nature, of the world awakening. And let yourself notice the way in which you're seated as you start to perhaps gently rock yourself back and forth. As you inhale and exhale through the nose. Breathing in. Breathing out. Pause at the center, ground through both sitting bones, lengthen through the spine, inhale. And then as you exhale, shift your weight from side to side this time. Maybe you start to mobilize your spine a little, your shoulders, but let the movement be small and organic. Take a deep breath in and out. Pausing the movement at the center, ground through the sitting bones. Inhale, take your arms out and up. Move slowly as if you were moving through honey. Interlace your hands overhead and flip your palms up toward the ceiling. Ground through the sitting bones again, lengthen through the entire body, breathe in, lengthen even more. Breathe out, lean a little bit toward the right, opening the left side body, maybe your gaze goes to the left now. Back through center as you inhale, lengthening a bit more. Exhale, lean the other direction, once again keeping the sitting bones grounded and opening through the side body. Let your gaze go wherever it serves you most. Inhale back through center, fine length. And as you exhale, release your hands and roll your wrists down as you lower your arms all the way down. Bring the fingertips to the floor next to you, fine length, inhale. Exhale, bring the right ear to the right shoulder. Stay there or lift your chin up and down, noticing the sensations that arise today. And then slowly bringing your neck back to neutral. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, take the other ear toward the shoulder, opening through the right side of the neck this time. Consider if you want to move your chin up and down until you find the sensation that serves you. And then slowly return your neck back to neutral. Reach your arms out and up this time. Inhale, palms unite overhead. Exhale, draw your hands together in front of your heart. Keep your palms together and as you inhale, take your arms forward, open them out to the sides, squeeze your shoulder blades toward one another as your gaze lifts. Exhale, take your arms forward and round your back, look down toward your navel. Inhale, open up again, lift your chest. Exhale to round, taking the arms forwards. One more, inhale to open. Exhale to round. Lower your hands to the floor in front of you. Lift your chest a little bit, breathe in. And as you breathe out, maybe your hands walk forward until you can relax down. Your elbows could find the floor or not. Relax your head. Inhale. Long, slow exhale. Press through the sitting bones. Use your core to lift yourself up. Inhale, take both arms up. Exhale, take your hands behind you. Lean back enough to bring your feet in front of you and start to draw your knees gently toward one another. Your hands could remain on the floor here, so could your feet. Draw your belly button in and up and your thighs toward your chest and maybe stay or as you inhale, you lift your right toes and as you exhale, you lower them down. You can do the same with the left foot. Inhale to lift, exhale to lower. You could continue that way, alternating or perhaps as you inhale, you lift both feet and as you exhale, you could lower them back down or you could leave them floating. Start to consider what you want to do with your arms. Maybe they come underneath your thighs. Maybe they lengthen forward. Inhale. 
Exhale to lower either one foot or both. Inhale to lift. Exhale to slowly lower your toes. Draw the soles of the feet toward one another. Draw the knees wide. Inhale to lift your chest as you catch opposite knees or shins. Exhale, wave your spine forward and down. Relax your head down. Inhale, lift your spine back up, waving up. Lift your chest, lift your gaze. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, slowly rise back up. Exhale, this time bring your hands behind you, feet parallel to one another on the floor, knees face up toward the ceiling. Feel free to stay here or on your next inhalation, press through your feet, press through your hands and lift your hips up, keeping your gaze forward at first in a reverse tabletop. Or maybe your gaze goes up toward the ceiling. Breathe in. Breathe out, lower your hips all the way down if you lifted them. You could cross your ankles here and roll forward, or you could slide your legs to one side and then bring yourself to tabletop. If your knees are sensitive, place a blanket underneath. If your wrists are sensitive, make fists instead of planting your hands wide on the floor. Inhale, lift your tailbone, dip your belly, look forward or up. Exhale, round your spine and gaze down. Inhale, lift your chest. Open up to the front body. Exhale, maybe your toes stuck and as you round, you lift your knees off the floor. Inhale again, arc and lift for cow pose. Exhale, round into cat. Maybe your shins, your knees float. Lower your knees back down. Inhale, bring your spine to neutral. And on the exhalation, bring your big toes to touch, separate your knees and send your hips back toward the heels. Maybe make a pile with your hands to rest your forehead down or take your forehead down to the earth. Move your hips side to side, breathe in and breathe out. Lengthen your arms forward once again, press yourself back to tabletop, aligning your knees underneath your hips. And on your next inhalation, take your right leg behind you, toes on the ground or floating, it's up to you. Exhale, draw your right knee toward your chest and then plant your foot between your hands. For some of us, you may want to grab your ankle with your hand and help it forwards. Your fingertips could remain on the floor or come up to your right thigh. Inhale, start to lift your chest. Roll your shoulders back and down and send your hips slightly more forward. Perhaps you stay or reach your arms up. You could also tuck your left toes and start to lift your left knee off the floor to find a little bit more strength through the legs. Breathe in. Breathe out whether your knee is lifted or lowered. Bring your palms together in front of your heart. Extend them forward as you breathe in. And as you breathe out, frame your right foot with both hands. Bring your right leg behind you and stay here in tabletop. Or maybe walk your hands just slightly forward and tuck your toes, lift your knees and your hips up and back and find yourself in downward facing dog. Wherever you are, take a deep breath in. Long, slow breath out. Noticing how the energy is moving and how you feel today. One more breath. Inhale. Exhale. Find yourself back in your tabletop. And on your inhalation, take your left leg behind you this time. Your toes can stay on the floor or float. And on the exhalation, you could drag your toes forward or let them float as you bring your knee to your nose. And eventually left foot between your hands with any help you may want to give it. Find stability in your low lunge or consider maybe you rather lift your right knee off the floor, keeping your hips square to the front. Your hands could rest on your left thigh as you lift your chest. Or maybe on your next inhalation, you send both arms up toward the ceiling, facing your palms toward one another. Draw your left hip gently back and your right hip gently forwards. Inhale. On the exhalation, bring your hands together in front of your heart. Extend both hands forward here. Breathe in. Breathe out. Frame your left foot with both hands. And this time, step your right foot to the top of the mat. You could take several steps for one big step. Feet parallel to one another, hands to the floor, to the shins, to the thighs. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. Take your arms out and up. Stretch. Perhaps your gaze lifts as well. And on the exhalation, bring your hands together in front of your heart and release them next to your body. Palms face forward. Roll your shoulders back and down. And just like you did at the beginning of the practice, seated, this time let yourself rock back and forth. Noticing the weight shifting from the toes to the heels. And then moving a little side to side. Eventually slow down the movement, roll your shoulders back and down, and perhaps your arms remain 
hanging next to the body or you bring one hand to the abdomen, one hand to the heart. Soften your gaze or close your eyes and observe how you feel after just a few minutes of movement, of breath, of letting yourself start the day in alignment with how you truly feel. Take a deep breath in and out. And I invite you to consider perhaps an intention for your day. After you've moved and noticed how you feel, what you need, the capacity that you have, how can you support yourself a bit more today? What is one thing you can do or explore or tap into? Deep inhalation through the nose. Side out. Once you feel complete, you can release your arms, you can open your eyes. I invite you to take a moment to roll your wrists and your ankles, maybe even shake your body a bit. And I hope that you have enjoyed this 10 minute morning yoga practice, that you feel energized and ready for your day. I invite you to try this class daily for a few days and see if it makes a difference in how you move in your life. If you've enjoyed this class, I invite you to try these as well. And until I see you again, take care of yourself and be well. Bye everybody.